Hello and welcome to this How Tech video tutorial. In this video, we're going to show you how to install Microsoft Office 2016. So here we have the Filipino version of the site. Here's the US version. Basically the same thing, except over here it has all the products laid out. You have a few different options for home, personal, business. I'd recommend looking into detail on the different things they offer. You can also buy separate products if you only want those. You also have a university bundle here, which is currently the bundle I'm using, and what I'd recommend is pretty good. So for this example, we're just going to go ahead and click on one of these. It's basically the same installation process for each one. And once it shows up, and it's what we're looking for, we can hit buy and download now. And before looking into all of this and trying to buy something, I'd recommend, especially if you work for a company that does this sort of work with office products, or you're in a university, I'd recommend checking it out and see if they have any sort of special deals on these products. So once we've bought, and maybe if we didn't install it right there, we can go ahead and view our account. This is what our account page will look like. We can go ahead and click services and subscriptions. And that should have our subscription plan right over here. So here it is added to our cart. And once we do buy and install it, it'll appear here. And we can install Office there, especially on any separate computers that you may have. Just make sure that the plan you have includes installation on multiple computers. You can remove the PCs and get the subscription plan with all the Microsoft Office products onto another computer that you may have. Here's the installation process. It'll go ahead and download that and you can just follow these simple instructions. Just click that once it's done downloading. Say yes, go through the installation, stay online and it will download all your Office products that you've purchased. Another thing you can do is when you go over here, remove those PCs. For this particular product, I can only have two PCs or laptops connected and installed on, so we'd have to deactivate one of these installs if we wanted to install it on another computer. This has been a How Tech Video tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.